Well, hello there, Tour. Hi, Consuela. <laughs> it's Friday. It is Friday. And I think we're both very excited. I feel like we're coming into this with a lot of Friday energy. Yes, we we are. We are. <laughs> um, although I, I I do have to uh, get started with with a little bit of egg on my face. Oh. Yeah. So um, it was it was pointed out to us by the uh, one and only Buck Dallas. Buck Dallas, yeah. That um, that I, I was wrong in my correction of you about uh, what penultimate meant. <laughs> uh, I have apparently misused that word for years. Mm -hmm. uh, I actually did think that it meant last rather than the item before last. Mm -hmm. And uh, yeah, so um, so that's that's my bad. And mm -hmm. um, in addition to that, <laughs> uh, I, I also. Uh, oh, apologies to uh, Cliff DePau mm -hmm. for missing their store last week. I, yeah. I'm the one in charge of the teleports, and I just uh, I just missed them when I was going through the note card list. Uh, mm. So apologies to Cliff DePau for that. <laughs> I know you were just so devastated when you found out about the errors after the video was done. I know. <laughs> But I thought I was I, amused. You know, Buck Dallas is amusing, as always. But yes. for him to say that, hey, by the way, penultimate does not mean last. And then, uh, you know, he even provided, you know, how he knew that. And it was from video games that, yep. you know, it announces the penultimate boss, right? Which is the boss before the big boss that you mm -hmm. have to beat. And I was amused by that because as an educator, I have run into many instances where my students bust out some fancy vocabulary on me that's not in our curriculum. And I'm like, excuse me, where did you pick that up? And then they go on and on about their favorite game that uses that kind of vocabulary. And I'm like, kudos to game makers for using nice vocabulary. Yeah, yeah, absolutely. And it's, I mean, it's not just vocabulary either. Like uh, video gaming has it, various forms of video gaming, like not all genres, but several genres also like increased problem solving skills mm -hmm. and uh you know management type skills and uh decision making and things like that yeah i would agree with yeah. you there's a lot to a lot of positive things that come along with video games like i'm always a little like irritated when people blame video games for like the world's problems um mm -hmm. but you know there's definitely a lot of learning that can be done in video games so yeah yeah. absolutely but yeah so i uh, for my part i am wearing some alutia i'm very excited about this <laughs> because mm -hmm. uh the the creator behind alutia reached out to me after the last video because um she had noticed how often i make comments about things not fitting me because i'm a big girl and well, the one before last well the one before last was it yes it was you're right yeah. you're right yeah because so it was two weeks ago um, but I, Alotia wasn't on the list last week, so I didn't bring it up and I wasn't wearing any Alotia, but now I am. And so, mm -hmm. uh, yeah, so I'm wearing one of, it's a Cho outfit and I love it for many reasons, but, uh, it's very boho, but, mm -hmm. uh, you know, it's using the juicy boobs if I zoom mm -hmm. in and, <laughs> um, and it's not giving me alpha problems, which is amazing. Cause normally I have to wear some other concoction, some of rigged, uh, you know, just not rigged, but, you know, rig up some some alphas from other outfits to block out the parts of my boobs that poke through this. Thank you for that. You're slapping me when I'm trying to go on close. <laughs> but my sound's off, so they can't hear all the, be the belly noises. So, um, And then, you know, I do have a belly. And so there is a little clipping here on the belly, which one of the reasons that, uh, like I said, Alotia or, uh, you know, Catalina Staheli is the designer that she was reaching out to me is because she wants to be all inclusive. She wants to be her things to fit all types of bodies. And I was just really, just really impressed by that. And so yeah, she invited. She would reach out to you yep. to uh, diversify the body shapes that her clothing fits on. Yeah. And I told yeah. her, uh, so she was reaching out to help me or to invite me to kind of test things out for her, you know, just to join her blog attacks. And, you know, I'm starting to, you know, pick up. I've been on blog attacks before. I've been a blogger and SL blogger before um, and, you know, a brand manager for Wicca. 
for Wicca's originals. So I still have a blog of text, but I just wasn't really active with it. But like Lulu B got me started on that again. You know, she hooked me up to use her things as well, which, you know, I definitely, I still need to, you know, put, put some more of her things on. She has a lot of nice accessories and like decor, like really like, you know, what I would call like metaphysical occult kind of decor. And I've been, mm-hmm. you know, I've been pressed for time, but I want to decorate a room with uh, Lulu Bee's things. And um, with Alotia though, it's clothing. So, you know, I'm always looking for clothes and things to wear with Reborn. So, you know, she invited me to join her blog text, which I did. So I grabbed the Cho outfit and I uh, was talking to her about this kind of clipping issue I have going on in the belly. She was helping me sort it. Um, and then she was going to talk. She was mentioning uh, giving me an alpha for it. So um, she hadn't gotten to that yet. But she I don't think I told you this tour. She was asking me what um, what would be a good name for her, like curvier sizes if she's like oh. rigging for curvier. And she, you know, plus size is what's often used, but there's a catalog I get (laughs) that, uh, because I'm a plus size girl in RL, uh, or as you like to say, first life. Um, And uh, they call their sizes, their plus sizes, goddess sized. So I pitched that to her. She didn't tell me which one she was going to go with, but I'm, you know, quietly rooting for goddess. So I hope Alutia comes out with goddess (laughs) sizes. And I am thrilled about that. So Catalina Staheli, thank you so much for reaching out to me and trying to, uh, you know, worked with me to, for me to help you and we'll help each other to be more uh, plus size, goddess sized inclusive. Um, Because I even told her I've had to use an alt, a skinny alt to wear her things because I love what she has out there, what she's created. Yeah. Um, and I want to wear it. So I <laughs> pop out an alt to do it. And you know, most people will be like, la la, just make your fat ass skinny and then you can wear her shit. And uh, no, <laughs> no, that, nope. your size goes one way. <laughs> That's up, up, right. So not down, <laughs> tour gets upset. So if yes, I'm going to be I skinny, do. I can only do it on one other avatar and uh, and that's it. <laughs> My other avatars are off limits there. None of them are skinny except for the one. And so then, uh, yeah. So that's why I've worn Alutia's things in the past. So I'm really excited that she's working on goddess sizing and <laughs> I can't wait to see more. So yeah, this is the Cho outfit. Um, I'll have to, between uh, fading to blacks, I'll have to tell you where to get it because I forgot. <laughs> and so um, <laughs> it's at an event. It's new. It's fabulous. It has a lot of options with the HUDs. Like Tour and I were matching each other and we were, I was like, wait, wait, I got to go through the HUDs. It's got solids. It got, it's got, I can't even talk. <laughs> it has solids. It has florals and it has boho yes. and all of these options in the fat pack or the mega pack, whatever she's calling it. So there's a lot of choices. So I'm really excited. Yeah, I'm, I'm super excited about that. And just so thankful to Elotia for, for, you know, even considering doing that, like it's really a huge step, uh, I think, uh, for creators to start embracing all of the body shapes that are, uh, represented on the grid and, you know, in first life as well. Yeah. (laughs) Absolutely. So, you know, I, it's just my normal commentary about, you know, when I see clothes, they look cute, but I know they're not going to look good on me because I'm curvy. And to have a designer actually hear me and say, hmm, let me do something about that, I think is really yeah. cool. Love it. So, so thank you, Catalina Staheli. Yes. All right. So, what else do we have before we launch into? I can bring up Seraphim and see what Anna Banana says. Well, so. While you're doing that, I will say our sponsors this week are Lock and Tuft and Offline. Mm-hmm. Lock and Tuft and Offline. All right. So mm. Anna Banana says the perfect weekend starts with 50 Linden Fridays. How true that is. It is very true. I'm looking forward to the perfect weekend. <laughs> and I'm going to scroll this page because I love Seraphim's little Polaroids. I think the way they organize their page is so cute. So it Mm -hmm. looks like a lot of good stuff on here. And then as far as any MIA at the time of Anna Banana posting, vinyl was missing their offering. So I don't know if that's still the case. It may not be. Probably not because, you know, Anna Banana's early and we're late. So. Yep. We'll find out though. We will. All right. So are we good to go or is there anything else? 
We'll, we'll yeah, we'll, we'll get well, started. You don't want to talk about your look because you know I was you were showing me some new stuff uh, and I was sure. like, check you out with your fancy beard and new hair. <laughs> well, I mean we can. It's not from Fliff though, so I, no, I feel but, a little weird about it. But no, yeah. Psh. Um, so uh, I decided I wanted to just poke around and see what was uh, over at an access event uh -huh. uh, and decided to pick up pretty much a whole new look. Like I, I was able to spot a new hair there by Van Gogh, this mm -hmm. new beard by Magnificent, um, which is pretty cool, I have to say, because it was rigged actually for my Jake? specific Oh, oh your head. head. Oh. Yeah. Um, this outfit, top and bottom, uh, is by TW. What is TW again? Totally Wicked. Yep. Okay. And, uh, yeah. And I forget who makes... I, I wasn't... Sorry, I wasn't ready for... No, I was just myself. mainly talking about your hair and beard. You don't have to give us the head okay. to toe. It's fine. Yeah, but yeah, yeah. especially yeah. since you're you're like, oh, but it's not Fliff. It cannot be discussed. Yeah. Which is funny because... Was it Zipper who said... I don't know if she said this to just me or us, but she feels like we're like the Fliff cheerleaders. We are. And... I mean we yeah. are we are because we we love fliff and i don't have time to shop all the events so i want to go for a nice you know short nice collection of designers for good prices and fliff is where it's at in my opinion for my my time frame yeah i mean i that's the thing it's it's the perfect size and it's a reliable like weekly schedule so it's it's a very fresh catalog like every mm -hmm. week you can mm -hmm. count on it and the fact that it lands on friday just makes it a wonderful thing to look forward to if you're not chopping fliff you're not chopping right <laughs> <laughs> wow that's a statement i'm sure barb and zipper and all the fliff crew are like that tour blanche he is the best cheerleader on the grid I need to get you some pom poms, and you need to like be like, go fliff, go fliff. <laughs> now speaking of go fliff, we should probably get to it. We should probably get to it. All right, so let's do it. Well, it looks like you found some pom poms. Give me an F. Give me an L. Give me an F. It's fliff. Woo! Go flip, but I don't see you dancing. You're just standing there. You were dancing a minute ago. What? Turn I'm off your AO. Dancing. No, uh, not on my screen. My You're not. Is, my AO is what makes me dance. There it is. There's the dancing. Okay. All right. There <laughs> we go. Do it again. Give me an F. <laughs> yes. Give me an F. Give me an L. Give me an F. It's flip. Woo! <laughs> Okay. Okay, that's fantastic. I told you, you look great. You look great, just like that. Yeah. <laughs> so we keep dancing because it's fabulous. Yeah, um, yeah. So we're at our first sponsor, which is Lock and Tuft, and they yeah. have a few things going on. Are all of these items fliff, fliff items? Uh, uh, yeah, they appear to be. Um, okay, so climbing. where are we starting? So yeah. I know where to cam. So let's start with these uh, mirrors. That, th that's mirrors. what caught my eye. Those are cool. Yeah, they are cool. So you've got three different color options. You've got like that silvery, uh, the brassy gold, and then the crazy multicolor, which is what mm -hmm. really attracted my eye. Mm -hmm. I don't know about you. <laughs> Same. That one did. Yeah. 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 <laughs> yep. I'm buying that one. Yeah. They call that hollow. Of course. Uh, holographic. Yeah. Then we've got uh, the bunny hat and ears. Mm -hmm, which I think they've done before, haven't they? I think so. I've seen mm -hmm. them before. And they're animesh ears you can attach separately, it looks like. Mm -hmm. Yeah. And you've got just a uh, hat The hair. beanie. Uh, yeah. The beanie. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Well, I know I'll get the mirror, the hollow mirror. Yeah. Yeah. But yeah, that's, that's, that's fantastic. Fun. Yeah. I always enjoy the quirkiness of luck and tuft yeah same <laughs> all right all well right. i'm gonna pick that up we're good to go uh, yeah we're good to go all right tour we are at offline i know this and People, it's plastered everywhere yeah yes we're at offline. we are at offline 
And before we get into Offline's offering, I was distracted mm-hmm. by your dancing and pom poms at the mm-hmm. last stop. Our first sponsor, Lock and Tuft. That's distracting. You are very, very distracting in your own special way, mm-hmm. in a very good way. But I wanted to tell people where this outfit came from. Like I said before, yes. it's Alutia, <laughs> it's a Cho outfit. Couldn't remember where it was from. So I got my fat ass back on Blog Text to see. It is at Famished, which opened on the first. So if mm-hmm. you are interested in all this Cho goodness, um, check it out at Famished because it's great. And like I said, I cannot get over juicy boobs. And I was so resistant about them at first because you were zipper asked me, do you use juicy? Do you use mounds? I'm like, no, I don't want to worry about boob attachments. And then I finally <laughs> came around. I cannot get enough. Like I want every dress and every top to have juicy. I love them. Yeah. They're just so realistic. I love it. Okay. Yeah. It's just squeezing that flesh. Yeah. We love it. We love squeezing the fat, fat flesh. <laughs> yes, absolutely. All right. So offline has this dress. It's yes, a Rita dress. Is that how you would say it? I would say Retta. Retta is also good. Yeah. <laughs> and so it's Maitreya Freya Hourglass Legacy Cupra Cup. So there's no Reborn here. So no, not for me, not today. Yes. But no. we have all these lovely colors. It's a great dress um, mm-hmm. and lots of colors. And each one of them is 50 linen, right? Yes. Each color is 50 linen or the fat pack is 900. Okay. And right yep. next to it, though, is a Saturday sale. Are both of these things Saturday yeah, sale yes. next to it? Both yeah. Both of those are Saturday sale. And they have Reborn on there. They do. So, yeah. Interesting. I don't know about those. It's interesting. Maybe on the other one, I don't know. Those 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 uh, metal strap or the metal hook loops, they look yeah. stretched on the model, let alone someone of my curvature. Yeah, that makes me actually so. really want to see it. On Why? Because you like distorted circles? Uh, just I could buy one. Rings I will buy one. So tell me what color. I'll buy it. I'll and get the red. The red. Okay. Yeah. yeah, I will get. I will pick that up. Yes, yeah, so you can be the, the bitch in the red dress. That's right, because, you know, <laughs> I have to compete with all the other bitches in red dresses for your attention, because you have so many bitches that want your attention. Oh, God. Uh, huh. okay so we good i'll get the red dress yeah. and maybe we i'll have good. i would put it on i don't think the thing said it's for juicy i uh, don't think it said so no yeah so maybe while uh you're getting us to the next stop i'll switch into it for fun's sake but then uh, i would have to no, change my I shoes don't... and stuff nah i like your current outfit all right can, uh, i'll, I'll put, put it on sometime this weekend and show you okay sounds good all right all right, tour. We know there's no guessing. We are at Ananas. <laughs> we are at Ananas. Now, what I'm questioning is what is the fliff item? Because there's a lot of goodness here. So the fliff item specifically is the bacon and egg couples. Oh my uh, goodness. Couples items. Okay, can I stop you right now and say you're the bacon and I'm the egg? Yeah. That's totally makes sense. Because look at how chunky that egg is. Yeah. That's my shape right there. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so I've got the bacon. Uh huh. And I'll be the egg. Mm-hmm. And then you've got some other things going on here. Yeah. So they have 50% off. You can get uh, peanut butter and jelly and cereal and milk. They are basically building items that, yeah, always go together. Yes. <laughs> That's. So we cute. need to go to more parties where this kind of outfit is necessary. Or where it's not necessary and just show up in it anyway. <laughs> uh, it makes me, you know, I was never that person. And maybe, maybe I don't know about you, but because, you know, you always surprise me with your little, like, tour facts. But, you know, people do, like, those couples costumes for Halloween. Yeah. And I've never been that person, but I want to be that person in SL. Like, Ananas just has you outfitted for that kind of thing. It does. It does. So this Halloween, we need to find a party and we need to put on some ananas and go. Yeah. I mean, we've we've done. The, oh, that sort I lost of style sound. Hang on. Hang on. My headset, my headset died. I'm going to fade to black real quick. Mm-hmm. OK, I'm going to apologize for cutting to her off because I'm sure everyone else on the video <laughs> could hear him. But my headset died. So I had to cut out abruptly find an old pair of headphones, plug those in so that we can keep on fliffing. 
Yeah. So do you remember even what you were saying when I'm like, hold up, I can't hear you? Um, well, I was saying that uh, we have done like couples things for Halloween, but we tend to do it a little bit more seriously. Like we, we did the Calavera look, mm, I remember. Yeah. Um, but uh, yeah, these are very whimsical so and would be good for just a, uh, a fun, goofy sort of costume party. Now, yeah. I can't help but notice that while I was gone, you put food in my hand. <laughs> Yeah, I couldn't do it through the wardrobe because I think oh. you're not currently wearing it. But I was able to dig up. We still have the other way that I can oh. put food in your hand. So I figured that would be good because you you sounded like you were a little frustrated with your headset. So yeah, this one I is maybe fun. Some donut milkshake would make you. Uh, I don't and think you're giving you're giving it the thumbs up. I so am. I, I approve. It as well. <laughs> well, this one I haven't seen in a while, and so I must not have it set up in the wardrobe. Uh, the new system. Be. So mm -hmm. I'm glad that you still had the old system, that we still have the backup system, because <laughs> I probably am not wearing my wardrobe because you're like, oh, damn, she's I can't put food and in her hand. It occurs to me what we should do is put the wardrobe HUD into this system so I can put it on you and then I can use the wardrobe. There you go. I can do that. <laughs> Remind me to do that when we're not trying to flip. I know. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's a great idea, okay. though. You're a problem solver. You're a solution. It's all about <laughs> solutions. <laughs> and I know this. Yeah, so. Okay, so yeah. are we ready? I know we've spent long enough here as I fussed with my headphones. Yes, we, the bacon and egg, are ready to move on. Yes, I need to buy the egg, and then we can yes. go. Okay. <laughs> all right. We are at Apple Blossom. Apple Blossom. And we have... Yes. And again, I see the little birthday bash sign. That's coming up August 12th. Yeah. <gasps> it's today. It, oh, yes. It, yeah. Starts today. Oh, uh, we have to do that. We will have to find time for that. We still have to flifty too. Okay, so but we're, I, think, I think we should prioritize doing the bash maybe tomorrow morning or something. But what about the flifty? Are we doing it Sunday morning? We can try to do it Sunday morning, but okay. I want... I, I think we should try and get ahead of one of these. Like, this is an opportunity to. <laughs> yeah, it just opened so. today. Yeah. Okay, yeah, I agree. So tomorrow morning, <laughs> we are going to the bash. Yes. All right. But let, for now, let's focus on Fliff. The Fliff, yeah, so not the bash. So this is a little side tie cute top. Yeah. And it looks like Legacy Perky, Maitreya Petite, and Reborn. Mm -hmm. So I I do I would do this because you know the knot is not like uh, across my belly, which always makes it look distorted. I think this would look yeah. really good, actually. I do too. So I'm picking I these up, too. and so yeah. you get two for fifty linden, two for or 50. four yeah. for a hundred. Yes. Yeah, and I like those patterns. Who doesn't need a black shirt or a white shirt? And I then really the, like the white one with the uh, the, with flowers. the flowers. Yeah, that, that one jumps out at me too. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. I'm gonna Great get this. Good job, Apple Blossom. Yeah. Look forward to wearing it. Yes. You ready to go? I am. All right, Tour. Where are we? We're at Asteroid Box. Asteroid Box, and they have We've got shoes. Max boots. Yeah. So they've got they're very stomper like. Yeah, they're very they're very punk. Uh, yeah. Sort of sort of style i like the optional chain is a nice touch mm -hmm, mm -hmm. what else do they say here maitreya beliza slink legacy oh let me should let me read it properly so maitreya lara which is the one and only body they have don't get me started on that one again uh beliza freya slink female legacy female unrigged uh signature gianni legacy male beliza jake 15 colors there's a hud uh, or there's pattern options included so you have plain and doodle options for the side with 16 color options for the front so there's lots of choices and you can yeah. see down here all the different and you get choices. all of those colors for 50 linen that is fantastic are you picking this up i am and this has purse potential for matchy matchy so yeah. if you would like to as well but if there's no reborn however there's unrigged right. And then I believe and Signature Gianni signature. Yep. will work with a Reborn according to Zipper. <laughs> yes, which we still haven't tested. I feel like I have, and I think she was right, but okay. you have to turn your feet off. 
So well, it depends because yes. there was another shoe. Like if I'm trying to wear a sneaker and I'm not wearing long pants, if I'm turning my foot off, usually the ankle is taken out as well. Mm. So it doesn't work in some scenarios, but if you have a completely closed shoe and you don't need your foot, then it works. And this is a completely closed shoe. It is. So yes, yeah. I will get it for matchy matchy Woo. for sure. <laughs> <laughs> All right. So we get to go. We are good to go. All right, Tour, you were a little uh, confused when you came over. Uh, yeah. And why is that? Well, Butterscotch has totally changed up their uh, display. I was not seeing the the large like wall that uh -huh. they usually have. They have these three smaller walls now. Mm -hmm. um, I think this does a better job of making it distinct which is the fliff and which is mm -hmm. saturday sale which i believe is probably why they've done it because it was previously all on like all on one wall mm -hmm. uh, and yeah so that's why i was a little disoriented it yeah was not were, seeing what i was looking for you were making confusing sounds after you landed <laughs> here <laughs> <laughs> yeah so but i believe you were saying that you like this yeah, this is 100% my style. It totally um, is. And, uh, you know, I've had kind of a mixed reaction to butterscotch offerings in the past, but this I'm all in on. I love this. Uh, it's, you know, just a casual sort of blazer on a, on a casual sort of shirt. It looks just nice enough that you could get away with sort of, not semi-formal, but, you know, it's it's a nice look um the texturing looks nice too i you know in my opinion mm -hmm. and um i like the creasing of the shirt as well yeah I think that's a nice touch i agree and i like the way the sleeves are pushed up it's very oh, yeah. realistic yes so very yeah it's definitely so uh... yeah so i i decided i would go ahead and pick up the fat pack of this oh good yeah yeah so then but, over on the others, then we have the so it's Saturday sale offerings on both of these others or no, one's TMD yeah. uh, weekend sale and then Saturday sale. So then the fat pack was over here then on the Saturday sale. Yeah, uh, they have the fat pack of that shirt on the Saturday sale. Uh, it is on sale mm -hmm. um, or you can get it the individual colors for 75. Did you get the bracelet too? No, I didn't get the bracelet as well. That's fine. I like my bracelets. You do. You, are... did, you did a nice job with your bracelets. <laughs> yeah, I mean those are those are fine. Mm -hmm. They're they're fine. But, but you have what I, you like. I'm pretty good with mine. Yeah. And what about these pants for the weekend sale? Um. Or do you have enough I'll, pants? I will try these out because you know how I am about wanting my my tops and bottoms, bottoms from to the same. Generally, be from the same maker. Mm-hmm. And can you remi so, remind people why that is? Uh, well, it's it's because they're a lot of times they're set up to uh, to drape a certain way. Like butterscotch here, uh, that shirt isn't gonna fit quite right over all all jeans. Mm -hmm. It'll ideally fit right over these jeans, or you know their typical pant cut. Uh, what I see a lot of is. Um, different makers like they have different waist heights for their pants which ends up with clipping the the belt or the the waist of the bottom through the bottom of the shirt or vice versa where your um where your shirt is like cutting into like the leg of the pants or something um and i find that that is minimized greatly when you get from the same maker mm. uh it's, it's not a sure bet, but it, it solves it most of the time. Yeah, I would agree with that. And yeah. you weren't seeing this, but I'm going to apologize for the viewers. My camera went wonky, and it was like crazy time while you were talking. <laughs> oh, that's okay. So, that's okay. Yeah, sorry, everybody. Okay, uh, we're all set here then? We are all set here. You are just in your element down there. Yeah. So what do we have here? And where are we? I should start with that. <laughs> We're at Celeste, and we have some 
Uh, they call them glittery lily pads. Uh huh. And floating lily orbs. Oh. And these I think I'm standing are... on some orbs. I think you landed me on something. I'm... So. Yeah, I landed you on the blue one. Whoops. Uh huh. That's fine. I'm standing on a floating lily orb. Yes. And you were seated on the glitter lily pads. Yes. So. Um. Yeah, these are super fun. This is great for, I think, decorating the surface of a little magical little pond or something. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I could I could see a few places on, on stratagem. To, yeah, I was thinking yeah. when you said magical, I was thinking about my little magical area. Yeah. And that I could see these over there for sure. Yeah, because you've got a pond near there. Yeah, true. Mm -hmm. These would, yeah. They would work very nicely. Yeah, So you these have, are very fun. You have picked these up then, I assume. I have picked these up, yes. Okay. All right. Any other comments before we move on? Uh, nope. They're very comfortable, but we can move on. Well, actually, you know, I'm thinking about Mama Lala, and she likes to know about land impact. Oh, oh, okay, okay. Land impact. We've got uh, two for the glittery uh, lily pads, and mm -hmm. the floating orbs are just one each. One each. So are they individual orbs? Like... The li I'm sorry. Are they individual glitter lily pads? No, it says it's four meters, so it must repeat. Right. Yeah, the lily pad pad, the, the whole cluster of the lily pads is to impact. Mm -hmm. And um, and the orbs themselves, the floating lilies, are one. Right. Because like yep. Mama La likes to point out, not everybody has an overabundance of prims like, yeah, like I, the Blanches I, do. <laughs> I can understand that. Absolutely. All right, now I think we're ready. Okay. Okay, I know we're at Commoner. Mm -hmm. And I'm going to say this display looks really familiar to me. <laughs> so I remember the Negativity Shield candle because I bought it. Yes. And then this uh, Chatterbox for Gratitude I may or may not have. So I'll have well, to check. Yeah, you'll have to check. But uh, yeah. Yeah, I do believe. That they've had the candle out before, mm -hmm. but it's still a good item. It is. And uh, always always good to have more chatterboxes. Even if they're recycling them, we love the chatterboxes. <laughs> we do, we do. We played a little bit with Pylea when we visited her house. We did. I think we only we got did. like two questions in. And yeah, then we were like, and th then you were like camming her house and all her pictures. And then we went off and had conversation yeah, and we sat got distracted on the cliff. By the, yeah, we got distracted by the house. You got oh, yeah. distracted by camming her house, yes. I got distracted by the house. Because you're a cammer. Well, she also had a cat. Yeah. Like it was I think she had more than one. She hit, She did. She had a couple of cats yeah. in the house. Yeah. Okay. Well, Hi, Pylea. Hi, Pylea. <laughs> <laughs> I am going to check my inventory for this gratitude box, but I know I have that candle, so I don't need to search. But <laughs> okay. both of them are great, and each is 50 linden. Okay. All right. Where are we? We're at consignment. Oh, I think your AO uh, took over or something. Uh, I think it did. Let me fix that. <laughs> um, there you go. Okay. So we're at consignment yeah. and they have a chair. We're at consignment. Or do yes. they have the lamp too? Uh, that's a good question. They have the lamp as well. Okay. So it's two uh, items, this chair and that lamp. Wait. That's not a lamp. That's a clock. Oh. Um, I didn't notice it oh. until I clicked on it. Yeah, that's cool. That's an interesting piece. That is unexpected. Yeah. <laughs> what do you mean that's unexpected? Consignment well, makes I, fun things. No, it, yeah, absolutely. I'm not saying it's not a nice thing. I'm saying it was unexpected. We both mistook it for a lamp at first. Uh, yeah, I'm. it's just funny that you would. We didn't even I we didn't discuss it before I started up. And mm. I'm amused that you thought it was a lamp too. Uh -huh. <laughs> so yeah. Yeah. Okay. So we've got a chair and a clock. Yes. Um, so it doesn't look like it's a scripted clock, mm. which is which is fine. Mm -hmm. It just warrants saying. Um, uh, and yeah, this is called the gable patio chair. I like it. Yeah, I do too. 
I'm gonna. I think I'm gonna pick up both of these. Yeah, things. I figured I think you they're would. both pretty cool. Yeah, I'm gonna pick them up both up as well because I like an interesting piece like that clock. Yeah. So. And this is a very nice patio chair. It, it is very, very cushy and very cozy and very <laughs> wide. You know, a yes, girl like me needs wide. a nice wide seat. Yep, wide and it's uh, well padded. Yeah, yeah, well padded. You can lean back and just mm -hmm. enjoy snacks. <laughs> yes. That's yes. the best kind of chair. A snack yes. chair. A snack chair. <laughs> All right. We good to go? <laughs> we're good to go. I know where we're at, where we are, but when I got here, I'm like, sold. <laughs> yep. <laughs> so where are we? <laughs> we're a dust bunny. Dust bunny. And look and what they got have. The bun stick. <laughs> oh, how fun. Bun Absolutely. stick. So it dispenses that. And I guess so yeah. it's a decor item and you click it and then you get the item to hold. Yes. That is so um, fun. As always, I have to say I absolutely love Dust Bunny's displays. Why? They don't just have a box of these bun sticks that are just neatly on the shelf. It uh. is torn open. It is ready to just grab one there and shove it in your mouth. Like <laughs> it, it looks mm -hmm. like someone's been enjoying some of these. Right? It's like I all love melty. The way they do that. Yeah, on yeah. the t on the tabletop. Yeah, like somebody's just sat down to inhale a box of bun sticks. Yes. Because you know that would be me. <laughs> this would be true in our house. Yes. Yep. Mm -hmm. uh, and you wouldn't mind in the slightest. Mm -mm. I'd so. help you with it. I'd bring you the new a new box. <laughs> <laughs> You'd bring me but, the uh, strawberry bun sticks and then the uh -huh. uh, chocolate and vanilla bun sticks. Yeah. Yeah. Um, but yeah, I I think that the way that dust bunny always does this with their food items mm -hmm. is gives them so much character and i always appreciate it yep i'm sold i was sold as soon as i rezzed in uh-huh uh -huh. so. all right well i'm gonna pick these up and we are gonna head out to the next okay all right we are at Elikatira, and you know, one of the things that jumped out at me is that they have the old Fliff sign, which tends to throw you off. <laughs> it does. So it they does. have that like ombre Fliff sign, and you're like, no, thank you. I want my purple Fliff sign. Yeah, well, it's just not one that I look for. Yep. I'm I'm attuned to the to the purple. Yep. Now I see two items here. Elikatira is normally just the hair, but there's a dress here. So is that fifty yep. linden too? It is. Wow. What size is that for? That is rigged for... Lara Legacy and Reborn. Oh. Huh. Now, huh. I'll tell you, I am not a fan of maxi dresses in SL because yeah, they yeah. don't move well. Yeah. And I... Struggle, so. Yeah. I like for yeah. my, like, chonky legs to be showing as opposed yes. to just all... I don't know. The... I'm just not a fan of maxi dresses or long formals in SL unless they're like old school flexi because I just don't like the way that the mesh moves with the avatar yeah, on a long skirt and stuff. Yeah. Which, it, I, while I'm totally sympathetic to that, I I really do like maxi dresses. I think they're fun. I do an I, RL. I Yeah. And that's... I'll buy this one to try it out. <laughs> Uh, yeah, because it's only well. 15 linden, and I've never seen a Helicatera offer anything but hair. So Right, so I'm very curious. Yeah. So I'll pick um, up that dress, and it looks like, okay, so what is four it? Four color options. Okay, I'm zooming yeah. in. We've got an ombre, we've got some two florals, and then it looks like a rainbow kind of, is it stars? It's stars. Yeah, rainbow star yeah. pattern. Yeah. So, yeah, I'm all about it. I'll try it out for sure. Great. It's only 15 linden, you can't lose can't lose and then and this hair did we talk about the hair yeah. nope so Myla. It's a, like a top knot yeah it's a close to the head top knot mm -hmm. not big enough hair for you i feel <laughs> i need a very voluminous top <laughs> knot like i need a well, lot more volume than that yeah to to go with your voluminous body that's right <laughs> and as always elicatira is a bargain for 50 linden you get all these colors what was it like 218 or something like that where's the number it has uh, it on here somewhere it's a lot um, it's a lot. Yeah. Uh, 408. I'm sorry, 408. 104. <laughs> 104 <laughs> colors. 50 London. They're 408, it's 104. They're similar. Same, same thing. Close enough. <laughs> 8,000. Yeah. 
104, 8,000, same difference. So a lot, there's a lot. And look, you look at our friend. What is she? What is she? What is this called? A drow, right? Is she a drow? Uh, she's probably a drow. Yeah. Why are you laughing so hard? <laughs> it is, when you ran with the number thing, that cracked me up. <laughs> Okay, so uh, the drow found, I mean, it's not hard to do black and white, but I'm just saying, you've got 1,800 colors. Yeah, and she's, and she's, she's feeling a, it. She's feeling it. She looks good on her. It does. She's Absolutely a, does. She's a slim enough person that, that that amount of volume works for her. Yep. For me, it'd be like, it would look uh, unbalanced because I've got too much going on for a hair without that more volume <laughs> so right. yeah that's fantastic and now we're gonna take a stroll over to friday right yes we're gonna all take right. a walk all right i will spare our viewers the walk but we'll see you on the other side okay all right we made it we walked over to fridays we're at friday or friday sorry not plural and it looks like some sandals it does parker sandals in ink and for Maitreya and Legacy. Not for me. Not no. currently, anyway. Back in the day, when I was more Legacy, it would be. But as you would have it, I have switched bodies yet again. But, uh, you know, to be honest, I was in Legacy for a very long time. You were in Legacy for quite a while. Yeah. Mm -hmm. But Now, yeah. they do have for the Saturday sale an outfit that is for Reborn. Oh, let's look over there. Reborn Legacy, yeah. Oh, that's a nice pair of pants. Crop top and flared leggings both of those would fit me <laughs> and i think those leggings would look great on your ass i know they would because this <laughs> body has an ass that won't quit so i mean you you heard me all the time like drooling yes. over reborn asses i know I so know. yes i'm gonna buy the fat pack <laughs> of these pants uh -huh. because yes and then the tops let's see See, summer, summer, this one has a pattern that says Summer Vibes, which mm -hmm. matches one of the patterns on the shirt I'm wearing oh. that says Summer Vibes. Well, I'm going to have to get that then. <laughs> I, I yeah. guess I'll get the fat pack on that, too. So how much does the fat pack cost for Saturday sale? Uh, 350 for the top, 275 for the bottoms. Okay, that's a deal. Yeah, it's pretty good. All right, I'm going to pick those up. Even though Excellent. the fliff item wasn't for me, the uh, Saturday sale definitely is. Yep. Yep. So, all right. Well, I will get those and then we'll move on. Moving on. <laughs> you know what? I haven't faded yet, but you said the way you drug out moving on. Moving on. Moving on. <laughs> <laughs> all right, Tour, where are we? We're at Glam Affair. Glam Affair. And we have a skin. Not surprising, but it's called Rowena. Yes. That's and a lovely name. It is. And a lovely skin. It is. So it's made for the Luca Evo X. And then you have all the colors fair, ivory, sand, beige, honey, caramel, and almond. So, and what yes. does it say? Featuring Avalon head. And then some eyes. And the hair is by Doe. Yeah. Okay, so yeah, very nice. But as we always say, not looking for a skin at the moment. But if but you if are, you are fifty <laughs> Lintons is a good deal for yeah. one. And Glam Affair is definitely well known for their quality skins. Very much so. All right, I'm good to go. Are you? Okay. Yep. Okay, we are at half tier, and you mm -hmm. sound like you were gonna say something. <laughs> you took no, a breath well, in. No, no. <laughs> Go ahead. I was going to say that we're at half tier and they're doing that thing where you've got like a plant coming out of your head. Yes. This is a different one. Um, mm -hmm. They Miss apparently Daisy. have a line of these because uh, they had Mr. Sprout before. So mm -hmm. this is now Miss Daisy. Gotcha. Yeah. So this presumably is the uh, uh, feminine variant of this. Mm -hmm. <laughs> and we got up close and personal. This gal really yes. wants to be Miss Sprout. Sorry, Miss Daisy. Yeah. Yeah. So, yeah, I mean, uh, it's 50 Linden and it's cute. It and if it that's is. your vibe, there you go. <laughs> yeah. So, I think it's fun. 
It I is enjoy fun. Half Jerry always comes up with the they, they do, things. they do. They're a, yeah, another quirky designer. That's what makes things fun. Just yes. the variety of different ideas, because you know this is somebody's jam, you know. Absolutely. So, and I'm noticing this gal's dress, and I'm like butterfly dress, and there she goes. Bye, butterfly. See, she flew away. I think, I think butterfly dress would do very well with Miss Daisy. Right. Yeah. Yeah, she's got like her whole monarch butterfly dress on. Yeah, yeah, that's a lovely dress. It is. But anyway, that's not the fluff item. It's Miss Daisy. So come on down to Half Deer and get your Daisy for your noggin. <laughs> All right. <laughs> Let's go. Okay. All right, tour. Where are we? We are at Hose. Hose. And, uh, and I couldn't help but notice we have graduated, and there's a naked lady, but we've graduated uh, to a full butterfly from the butterfly dress. Although she's probably uh, not a butterfly, she's probably like a fairy. But yeah, yeah, I just thought it was it was cute. It's but, a really interesting look. I like her third eye that she's got. Going yeah, on. that is a very good look. So, yeah. all right, well there you go. Her ears are cute, are cool too. Yeah, but, you know yeah. that's the fun of SL, just the, all the different ways you can make your avatar look yes you can do all kinds of magic with your avatar yeah so i'm gonna cam away so we don't get naked girl but we have fellow juicy boob wearer friend up here the blonde yes and but we're at hose and it's a skin and yes does it have a name joy it looks like uh that's what the sign it says is joy yes yeah made for leluca leluca evo x in two colors, blush and icy, which I'm assuming are 50 linden each. Yes, so these are the velour colors, blush and icy. Mm -hmm. and yes, those are the those are those down there. Yep. So, uh, and again, another good deal if you're looking for a skin, especially if maybe you're a new resident and you want something nice, you can get a skin for 50 linden. And hose is another one that makes really nice skins. They absolutely do. So, all right, with that, are we ready to head to the next? We are. All right, Tour, where are we? We are at Hilted. Hilted, and they have these oh. little droids. Is that what I'm seeing? That is what you're seeing. These are funky little droids. And they're decor. For a minute, I got excited that they were like a pet. They are just decor, but you that's... get all, all of them for 50. That's cool. That's a pretty good deal. Yeah. All right. Are you picking those up? Uh, yeah. I was just looking at them. So they've got uh, they've got quite a diverse cast of little little droids there. Mm-hmm. And what as they always, they Happy seem Weekend? well made. Yeah, they definitely are well made. Mm -hmm. Uh, Terrage. Okay, so this is like a cyberpunk snack vending machine. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Well, I'm getting that as well. <laughs> That's fun. Yeah. Would, would this work in our solar punk somewhere? Uh, you know, I think it would, actually. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah. All right. Very good. Are you ready to go, then? Uh, yes. One. Okay, so it's really bright here at Pattaya, but it's not a bright that I'm upset with. Yeah, it's, it's very sunny. Uh, yeah, it's almost like beach sunny. It is. Much it's so. probably the environment here is probably like beach day or something like names like beach probably. So, or something they made who knows but we're not here for the environment we are here for the rugs <laughs> yeah but look at those clouds though yeah i know <laughs> you know i was just thinking i was like you know there was like what a video or two ago where like everywhere we went we're like ooh, environment and we've yeah. not had that since but pataya <laughs> makes me feel like i'm at the beach <laughs> <laughs> and you like big fluffy clouds. <laughs> I do. I do. So anyway, we're okay. here for the rugs. Rugs. Yeah. Yeah. So I was I was starting to gush and I, I said I have to wait until the video starts. Mm -hmm. These rugs hit a sweet spot that I am that I find myself searching my inventory for mm -hmm. several times when trying to do builds. OK, because um, there there are wrinkles in these rugs they mm -hmm. aren't sitting just perfectly mm -hmm. the texturing shows a little bit of wear in them mm -hmm. um like i don't mind like i like the the full-on messy rugs as well 
but there's absolutely a place for the rug to actually be flat mm -hmm. but they do this thing where they they make it not perfectly flat so it, yeah it it hits it just in that that really perfect sweet spot for a home decor item um so yeah i've gotten all of these because that that fine little detail just uh, is, is, is something that I have searched my inventory mm -hmm. for many, many times and foresee doing so in the future as well. <laughs> so now, how many so how many rugs do you get? Are there two in a set? So each, There are two in a set, yes. Each you one's get... 50 for the pair. Mm -hmm. Or you so get all of them for total. 400 and our 200 London. 200, yep. Mm -hmm. yep. I told you I couldn't numbers. I'm trying to make everything more than it is. It's not 8,000 hair colors. <laughs> it's not 400, Lyndon. It's two. So, okay. Yeah, I'm getting these two because I actually was harassed quite a bit. Uh, and I say harassed lovingly by our good friend uh, Nariko Okawa when uh -huh. she was squatting on my house in SL many years ago after I met her. <laughs> and she would call me like, what is it? The, uh, uh, what is it? the uh, Arabian rug dealer? Like oh, Persian rug deal. Persian, or, yeah, 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 yeah. So I would have rugs galore on my yeah. other on my alt, and so whenever she needed a rug, I would just res them everywhere, and she would laugh her ass off at how many different rugs I had and call me a rug dealer. Yes. So now I'm still doing it. So now I'm going to buy some more rugs in the event that Nariko Okawa, or as we call her Coco, needs some rugs because she knows if she ever needs a rug, she can come to me. Yes. Now. I do have to say, this is another reason why I, I do enjoy coming out to these in person. If you vault the wall and look down the wall a little bit, they have a set called Morocco Dreams, which I've also just picked up, which looks tailor-made to Where go am I with looking? these rugs. Uh, just on the other side of this wall that we're standing in front of. Oh, and the like actual just turn around. Oh, yep. There I see them. Mm. Yep. Mm. Okay, happy weekend. They've got like a nice little sideboard thing too. Yeah, the sideboard is cool too. Um, mm -hmm. I, yeah, I could see picking. I'll pick that up as well. Mm -hmm. I didn't even know that. <laughs> I didn't know if I just, you know, went around the corner that there was more things on the back. For all the times yeah. that we've come to Pattaya. Well, now normally they put their Saturday and such along this wall, mm -hmm. uh, along this fence rather. Um. And it looks like their Saturday sale is stuff is across from us, but uh, let's oh. see, they've got flowers, flowers and vases. Mm -hmm. and, uh, yeah, looks like they, I mean, that whole basin. little bathroom display might be a Saturday sale thing. And a camper trailer. Mm -hmm. Interesting. Okay. Oh, and there's the trailer. Okay. Yeah. Small, but cute. Yeah. And bead curtains. Yep, and they've got some nice wallpaper inside with like a rose print on it. That's nice. Yeah. Huh. Very good. Well, there's a lot here at Pattaya. <laughs> yeah, so, so. I, yeah, I've grabbed a few things. <laughs> yeah, I'm gonna have to do that too. So are, are, are we good to go so I can grab some things before we move on? We're good to go, yes. Okay, so we haven't left Pattaya yet. We did fade to black, and now we're back because we were. I was shopping, and I accidentally clicked the fence to realize there are beige rugs down there. So there are five sets of two. Yeah, I didn't see this either. So yeah, so they blend in. I appreciate in. you mentioning that. <laughs> <laughs> Can't miss out on some beige rugs. Yeah. So we just had to say that. So yes. now we good? Now we're good. Okay. Okay, we have made it to Pixie Cat. Pixie Cat. And they have Nova Set, which to me looks like a romper. It looks like they're attached. Uh, yes, it's hard to say. Yeah, um, it could be two things. The style definitely looks romperish. Yeah. And it is, uh, it does fit Reborn. It I know, I'm already all about it. <laughs> Legacy Hourglass Freya Reborn. Yeah, I'm gonna buy I know it. you love your rompers. Mm -hmm, I do. I only see one yeah. buy button, so does it mean that you're just getting you get, these three? 
Yes, you get but these three colors. But there's a fat pack somewhere because it says fat pack mod fat pack. plus 55 colors. Oh. So the, I got to know where that is and how much it costs. Because <laughs> uh, I yeah. love a romper. We'll look for it. Okay. Um, oh, I see it. Uh, do you want a cam on me and I'll walk over to it? Okay. At least Air cams. It yep, go for it. Okay, I think that it's right over here. Oh, and it is separate. Look at it. It is separate. Oh. Yeah, that's the Nova set. It is separate, Interesting. which means you can do tops and bottoms. But it definitely looks like it's romper-ish. I love it. I want it. Yeah. And I love the fact that you could do mixing and matching if you get this. Uh, yeah. How much is the fat pack? Because I want it. <laughs> uh, the full the full fat pack <laughs> yes. is uh, 1200 I got it. Okay. So uh, one of the things that jumps out at me is that I haven't let our viewers know this yet, but I, um, I DJ. Well, that's not a secret. <laughs> I think I've said that before. But um, I DJ for uh, Second Life Basketball, <laughs> which is a new yes. thing with uh, a friend of mine from the monarchy. So she owns a basketball team and I have uh, DJed for her for the game or for her cheerleaders to perform. And it's been a lot of fun. And I see an outfit in this romper that I would totally wear to the games because it's a referee. Yes. <laughs> and so I would absolutely, I feel like I have a uniform now because <laughs> I've been really close to asking her for like, can I have a cheer oh. uniform too? But oh my gosh, um, yes. but I don't want to be mistaken for one of the cheerleaders. Although it'd be great to have like a uniform, but this this is it. I'm going to dress as a referee in this pixie cat romper. It's perfect. <laughs> Absolutely. Yes. So, all right. I am sold. Do you have any other comments before I pick this up and we move on? I look forward to seeing you in this. <laughs> oh, you will. <laughs> yes. You know what I said when I landed. <laughs> it, it's dark in here. It's dark in here. Maybe you should put your flashlight on, but I have ice cream, so. <laughs> but uh, we're this is wrong, and we're almost at, we're almost at the end. So I don't know that we want to fuss with flashlights, but yeah, it is dark. Anyway, this is wrong, and it is uh, Demetria, Demetria tattoo. tattoo. Yeah, yeah, interesting. It's got like uh, interesting sort of bands. It's almost uh, tribal, but not quite. That's what I was thinking. Yeah. Yeah, it's a it like pulls back from it in an interesting way. Mhm. Mm and I like I always find the tattoos interesting that go from the head to the neck, you know, yeah. to the body. So that's always always fun. So this one's And they do have a left and a right. Okay. Okay. Yeah, well, the Luca Evo X is for that. A fresh and faded and a lot a left and a right option. So for 50 linen you get the whole that one look. Right. Yes. Uh, well, you get left and right. Version. Well, right. But it's yeah. not, but you know, because normally when we've come here before, it's like, you know, 50 linen for the black, 50 linen for the yes. red, 50 linen for the white, but that's not an option here. You're just 50 linen for this black. <laughs> yes. Yeah. You get yeah. it in black. Yeah. Correct. All right. And what else do they have for happy weekend? Looks like they have eyebrows. Let me look at that. Uh, eyelashes. Uh, sorry. Eyelashes. Huh. Interesting. Those are different. Oh, the witch yeah. eyelashes. Huh. Yeah. Do I want those? Huh. I'm not sure. They I, are kind I, of. They're different. They're longer and. and yeah. Yeah. They look of, like spider webs a little bit. Kind but, of wild looking. Yeah. yeah. I'm going to pick those up. <laughs> I'm going to pick at All least right. the black ones up. And then off to the other side, it's uh, what? Gift of the month? I'm assuming Gift is it for the, the group? They've got like floral pattern for the ear. Ear tattoos. And it looks like it works on the Leluca cow ears as we like to say although it yes. really is elf but um yeah so they've got some tattoo for the ears so if you're in the group i assume that's what mm -hmm. you get for being in the group and then they have some items at the sales room and wanderlust so they have the nizuko makeup and horn that's interesting mm -hmm. and then they have what is this here something cyber looking oh spirit, spirit animal animated, animated tattoo, tattoo. interesting yeah. Okay. Yeah. Very cool. All right. This is wrong. Got a lot of interesting things this week. So I'm going to pick up these eyelashes for Happy Weekend. And Heck then yeah. we can be on our way. All right. Off we go. All right. Where are we? Tori Torricelli. And we have a skirt or is it an outfit? It's a skirt. Uh, this, this one is a skirt. Yes. 
and it's a skirt that doesn't fit me. <laughs> Legacy, it does not fit you. Perky, Lara, Petite. Fliff exclusive patterns, though. So yeah, yeah. If you are looking for this, this is, yeah, Fliff exclusive. Fliff uh, exclusive. They do have the outfit, it looks like, for Saturday sale. Mm hmm. Okay. So there's a top involved. I mean, it's a lovely outfit. Yeah, so. it just doesn't do the reborn. Unfortunately. Yeah, and what is this here? Click here for the link to grab. Yeah. Marketplace promo. Yeah. So marketplace. But I don't even know what that fits. That other dress. I will check the marketplace to or see. Or check the demo. It's right there. Uh, Unless you don't want an inventory good. item. <laughs> I'll check the demo. Demo says Maitreya and Legacy. Okay, well, there you go. Mm -hmm. All right, I'm giving it a thumbs up because it's nice, but it doesn't fit me, so I won't be buying it. <laughs> yep. All right. All Off right. Off we go. Off we go. All righty. We are at Trump La Wheel, and we have two yes. very nice looking things. So the first one is a, an A-frame cabin. Mm -hmm. Which I'm going to tell you. Have you have you ever been in an A-frame? I have. I have too. They are fun. <laughs> they are very fun. Mm -hmm. I love when they are positioned in a way that you can watch like the sunset or mm. sometimes the sunrise through the big open uh, part of the A. Mm -hmm. um, and, and they almost always have lofts. Uh, yes, yes. And this one does too. And would you would this work for our solar punk? It uh, very well could. I think yeah. it could. I'm feeling like it could. I'm so, feeling it. Normally 425 linden for Friday. It's 50, and mm. there it's landed pack is 62 for all the mama lalas out there. <laughs> Good call. <laughs> Good and call. then we also have these canoes, which are adorable. They are. They're camp canoes. Yeah. And look what it says on the side of the canoe. Smooth sailing. Smooth sailing. But it looks like they all have different names. So Lazy River, Calm Waters, Lake Jammer, oh. Summer Breeze, and River Run. So that's what you can I make them say. Yeah. yeah. So I'm assuming these come with a HUD or something. Or there's just... Or, or all of these variants are in the box. Yeah. So. They may have different variations. Yeah. So normally 375 linen. But for today... 50. Now, are each one, I can't tell because my interface, but do you buy them each separately or is it just one you buy the the one? You get all of them. Yeah, that's what I thought because normally Trump doesn't like piecemeal it out like that. Yeah, so. you get all of those canoes for the for and that's, 50. that's fantastic. I'm going to get both of these things and I know you probably already too. have. So. Yes. Okay, yep. very good. Are we good to go? We are good to go. We are at your store. We're at Tylee, which I can wear now. Yes. And what do we have? We have the Aaron Cargo shorts in black and hollow. Okay. Very cool. What do you think? Uh, well, I will say I like these so much that I've already bought the fat pack of them <laughs> previously. <laughs> <laughs> of no, I, I came through the store... Uh, earlier this month or, mm. or last month and those were an item that I picked up and uh, yeah those are good ones yeah, sounds like it yeah they Sorry. also have these tops for 75 each okay do you have those uh, that's a good question I don't think I do I do not, so I'll probably pick up uh, one of those. Mm -hmm. um, but yeah, so I I have very much been enjoying my Tylee clothes mm -hmm. since making the switch. Um, so yeah. Very good. So then you're all set here. I'm all set here. All right, let's go. <laughs> okay. All right, tour. Where are we? We're at our penultimate destination. Wait, vinyl. wait. Did you say penultimate? I said penultimate. Does that mean we only have one more left? After this, yes. All right. 
<laughs> All right, so we've got this uh, bikini top and yeah. belt. So they've got bikini some houndsuit. Bikini top suit. and belt and shorts. Okay. And it uh, looks like it fits Maitreya and regular and petite, legacy and regular and perky, Cupra, e body, and that's it. Yeah. So, I mean, it's all right. I don't think it's really my my flavor, but uh, no. I think it's now, cool. They do have it in other colors, and I think the other colors are more convincing. <laughs> uh, over in the Happy Weekend, you can yeah, see. Yeah, I see that. Yeah, I'm, I wasn't feeling the hound's tooth. Is that how you say it? Yeah. Hound's tooth. Um, and so wait, so we've got Happy Weekend and Saturday Sale has some more choices. Oh, I yeah. see what they're doing. Okay, so Happy Weekend you buy the tops, and Saturday okay. Sale you buy the bottoms. But okay. on, on Flip you get one in Hound's tooth, tops and bottom and belt. Right. Uh huh. Gotcha. So yeah, which one of these? I mean, I could pick one. I think the bottoms would be fun because that would fit me for sure. Yeah, the top I agree. is fun too. That would fit too. I wouldn't have any problem with that. Yeah, and I don't know um, that they have a juicy version because you know I'm all I about don't the juicy. See a juicy. Oh no no, it says it on the sign. <gasps> it says it does. E body oh. reborn and juicy add on. All right, oh, sold. Okay. All and right, and wait right. wait wait, do they have a connection between the sleeve and the top? It looks like uh, I don't know if that's a connection or just a flare of the arm thing because you know me and my realism yeah, i don't know like who's gonna put on arm fluffs unless they're attached to the shirt i can't tell so anyway yeah no i'll definitely get one of these how much how much are they individually and then how much for the fat pack individually you can get uh tops for 60 you can get bottoms for 60. and fat packs fat packs you can get the tops for 600 you can mm -hmm. get the bottoms for 600. nice so i'm gonna look at these patterns and decide if i want a fat pack or not or just one set yeah, absolutely. So, all right, very good. Let me do that, and then we will move on to the ultimate, the final. Yes. Fliff creator today. Yes. All right, not all my textures are loaded, and that's okay. The fliff items are loaded, and that's what matters. <laughs> yes. So where are we? We are at what next? What next? Snacks. That's what's next. It's snacks. It's strawberry cheesecake, and you can wash it down with some iced tea. Yum. Now, typically, I'm not much of an iced tea person, like on the whole, like straight up iced tea, but like the variations of iced tea in yeah. First Life, I, I can do those. But like just original plain iced tea, not so much. Well, this looks, I mean, this looks like it's got some flavoring in it. To yeah, me. I would pretend that it does. I always like to have flavored tea as well. Like yeah. raspberry tea mm -hmm. is one of my favorites. Um, I have surprisingly had huckleberry tea, which is oh, very good. That sounds interesting. Um, I've had a lot of different teas. Mm -hmm. So we also yeah. have some strawberry cheesecake, which I always love. And, yes. um, and it's a dispenser, it looks like. I think they both are. They usually are. Yeah, so, they're both dispensers. Now, mm -hmm. I, the cheesecake looks familiar. It has, do, it you, is do you have it? Familiar. I do have it. Do you I have don't the know if it was for Fliff. It may have been for a Saturday sale, mm. and I scoped it. Um, do you have this iced tea, though? Because I really like the tray it's on, too. No, I did not have the iced tea set, but I do now. Uh-huh. And it does have a great little wicker tray. Yeah. Okay. Uh, I like the two versions of it, where one of them just has lemon slices. Oh. I would use the one with lemon slices. Oh, yeah. Mm-hmm. You're right. I hadn't even yeah. noticed it was two different versions. I thought it was just two yeah. rezzed models. But yeah, yeah, good catch. Yeah. My avatar so. approves of your observation. <laughs> yeah. So, always love what next they make some very refreshing looking stuff mm -hmm. and uh yeah okay well now, mm -hmm. oh uh do i have those i had to peek over of course you did because you're the camera where are we looking now we're looking across uh from us boho l l hanging do we, lanterns don't we have those i believe we do but you know i want to make sure people know they can get those yeah we do have those mm -hmm. And let's see if we have the other ones. I don't know about or the what? ones that look like they go on the floor, though. I don't think we have those. I think those are... What are they called? I can't read. The texture's not clear for me yet. Uh, the Malia Rattan Rattan Lanterns. Lanterns. I see it now. Those are cool looking. 
But these are full price things or are they Saturday sale? Uh, these are, uh, they may be full price. Cause I don't see uh, any signage near them. Yeah, they look like they're full price. And what is full price? Uh, 175 for the rattan mm -hmm. and 175 for the hanging lanterns. That's not bad. No, nah, not bad at all. Okay. So I, I think I'll get the rattan lanterns. Distracted. Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> of course you do. Okay. So, all right. So I'm going to pick those up and then we go home for closing thoughts. Uh, yep. And we're home. Well, we're not home. But we're in front of the dorm, as we call it, the Blanche dorm, that will soon yes. be raised for cyberpunk. Sorry, solar punk. Solar punk. Yes. <laughs> solar punk design. So we yeah. have been, like I said, I think it's still a wonderful idea. You're like, we should shoot our videos around the building we're going to be taking down. <laughs> yeah. So, yeah, it's been a great building, but uh, time it for has. some new design. We've all enjoyed it. Yes. But yeah, it is time to bring it down and bring about some solar punk. Yes. So do you have any closing thoughts for us? Ah, so, um, yeah, so, uh, we did of course enjoy, uh, this, this fliff and I, I do want to just circle back. Um, that I think it's just so hugely important that Elutia is is actually looking to make sure that their clothing, uh, you know, fits for for all sizes, mm -hmm. and hope that that leads to kind of a shake up and a little bit of a trend shift in uh, in creators. Yeah, it's definitely promising. I was very intrigued uh, when she mm -hmm. reached out and. Uh, you know, she has been actually, she actually is a past Visionaire graduate. Um, so, you know, I did oh. have some experience with her prior, but this was a whole, you know, it's been a while since she and I have spoken and um, it was, it was nice for her to reach out and have this, this conversation with me. And, you know, I think it's great that she's doing that. I'm really excited to see what she puts out. I'm very excited to see what she calls it. I'm again, rooting for goddess. So Catalina, if you're watching goddess, please. Um, <laughs> yes. <laughs> so, um, yeah, I, I just thought that was fabulous. Yeah. Um, aside from that, uh, you know, I, I, I do have to always mention a little bit of, and there's, there's just so much that's been going on this week, but, uh, I will just say with some of the more recent events, there's going to be a lot of speculation. There's going to be a lot of people trying to leap to conclusions about what things mean. Um, this is a case where the media is, it's not that they're publishing false information. It's that they're trying to get a story and we don't have enough information. Um, just be patient, wait for the information to come out. You know, right now things are very speculative. And for folks uh, who may not know what you're referring to. <laughs> uh, yeah, I'm referring to the FBI retrieving several classified informations, basically executing a search warrant on the former president's house here in my state in Florida. Mm -hmm. Um, so yeah yeah i just wanted to be clear about that because not everybody's uh is that's, dialed in i mean fair. i knew what you were talking about but you know <laughs> sometimes i have to remind you to tell everyone what you're talking to about to provide the context yes <laughs> right right yeah um so yeah um and aside from that psa um take you know even if there's not like CDC requirements or whatever requirements in whatever country you're in. There are things going around right now with rise of COVID and rise of monkeypox. Take precautions. Be careful. You know, be safe. Yeah, agreed. Anyway, those are my two things. Those are your closing thoughts. So I, I don't have anything particularly deep. I have been busy all week with school things and 
I'll just say it's been a great week for school. <laughs> um, woo. Woo. So. Oh, so I have to congratulate your state. Speaking of school. Okay. On passing free school lunches available for everybody. Well. That just that I. Well, a law just went into was signed about it. Right. I was going to say that's not a new thing for California. So yeah. in the years that I have uh, been in my position. Uh, especially during, I think it came a more about, actually, no, the school I was at before, it was free lunch for all, but you had to meet certain qualifications, like a certain population of the students needed to be at a certain socioeconomic level. And right. so that was before COVID. Then once COVID hit, it became free lunch for everyone. Like we were not mm -hmm. checking who, you know, checking lunch numbers and things like that. So, um, and then since coming out of COVID, it's just been a push to keep free lunch for all and yes. i think that's amazing i think it's wonderful i'm glad it's that the state made it official such a great thing yeah. yeah yeah as someone who's been in education as long as i have and seen you know how people have to fill out lunch applications to qualify for a free lunch and you know when you think about all the things um that children face uh, you know what varied backgrounds and what tr you know challenges they have and different traumas and things to you know, oftentimes for, for families and students, school is the only place where they can get a healthy meal. And mm -hmm. so to have to qualify for that seems ridiculous. Like we are a public yeah. free institution. So why not provide free meals to the students? It just makes sense. Yeah. I mean, you have a school nurse to render, you know, first aid, basically whatever a child needs while they're in your charge correct while you're there in your care should you know be available on the premises so mm -hmm. yeah i i think that's just such a such an important uh thing that got passed there and of course you know your state is a forerunner in a lot of programs so i'm mm -hmm. hoping that that also leads to a trend i hope so <laughs> you know here's to hoping so yep all right. So on that note, I think it's time for some uh, thank yous. So as always, oh, and I should say we are up to 80 subscribers. 80. So we are 20 subscribers away from a Speedo. Yeah. So yeah, I'm very excited about that. It's been a slow and steady march towards Speedo land and yes. uh, we'll get there. We will get We're there. We're going to get there. Yes. I have learned uh, in my years to be patient. You know, the whole good things come to those who wait is true. So uh, I'm being very patient and doing what I can to promote our videos so that people discover us and realize that they want to follow and subscribe and enjoy our videos. So for all the subscribers and everyone who watches our videos, thank you. I, uh, we appreciate you. Um, I'm enjoying the level of commentary going on in our videos. That really makes me happy. I know like <laughs> Mama Lala's not shy about writing a paragraph as a comment. Um, you know, Zipper will chime in, Buck Dallas, we, uh, you know, other friends and subscribers will make comments on our videos and I really do enjoy that. So thank you everyone for that. Um, I always reply. So uh, please continue doing that. And uh, you know, if you enjoy our videos, please share with your friends and invite them to subscribe as well. So thank you all for watching our video and we enjoy making these for you. And we look forward to sharing the uh, Fliff birthday bash with you. And uh, coming up after that would be the Flifty, which we are way behind on, but you know, we always get to it. So yep. more content yep. coming very, very soon. So thank you. <laughs> Excellent. All right, are we ready to go? We are ready to go. That means bye. Bye.